Good afternoon students, so uh, our objective this afternoon is we are going to rewrite again the general form given for a quadratic function to uh, the vertex form. But this time, we are not going to use, hindi natin gagamitin yung uh, solution or yung method na by completing the square. But instead, gagamit tayo ng formula to find the value of your h and the value of your k. So the formula for getting the value of your h is negative b over a over 2a and for the value of k naman is we are going to use k equals to 4ac minus b square all over 4a so kahapon or uh, we use the method of uh, completing the square just to transform the uh, given general form to vertex form. So, ulitin natin. So, ang una natin ginawa dati is we just transform the general form to vertex form gamit yung uh, completing the square. But now, this time, ang objective natin, ganun pa rin, pero gagamit tayo ng formula to find the value of your h, which is negative b over 2a, and to find the value of your k, nagagamitin natin formula is 4ac minus b square all over 4a. So now, to give you an example, subukan natin itong uh, uh, function na ito. So, f of x equals to x squared minus 4x minus 10. Transforming this to uh, uh, the vertex form, f of x equals to a times the quantity x minus h raised to 2 plus k. So, gagamitin natin yung formula na h equals to negative b over 2a and k equals to 4ac minus b square all over 4a. So, your initial solution will be hahanapin natin yung mga values ng a, ng b, at saka ng c from the quadratic function. So, from there, ang mga values natin are a value natin is ang a value natin will be 1 for a value and for b naman we have negative 4 and for c we have negative 10 okay so ulitin natin ang value ng a natin dito ay 1 value ng b natin dito is negative 4 at ang value naman ng c natin dito is negative 10 so we're just simply going to substitute this uh, values ng a ng b ng c dito sa mga formulas natin to find the value of your h and to find the value of your k so let's do it so, ang h natin is equivalent to negative b. Palaging may negative yan. So, sulat muna natin yung negative uh, sign. And then, we substitute the value of b which is negative 4. Okay? So, we'll be enclosing it by a parenthesis to emphasize that uh, your b value is negative 4. Tapos, yung may negative sign palagi dun sa formula natin. All over, ano yung value ng a natin? We have 1. So, 2 times 1. So, for k naman, we have, okay, so 4, ang value ng a natin is 1 alet, so substitute lang natin yan dyan, so we have uh, times 1, value naman ng c natin is negative 10, so substitute mo dyan, negative 10, minus ang b natin which is negative uh, 4, so substitute mo dyan, negative 4, kaso naka square yan, okay? Substitute natin kaso naka square. All over 4, constant, value ng a natin is 1. Okay? So again, kinuha natin yung mga values ng a, ng b, at saka ng c from the function wherein a mo is 1, ang b mo is negative 4, ang c mo naman ay negative 10. Ang target natin is to transform this into the vertex form na a times the quantity x minus h square plus k. So, aha, kukunin lang natin ang mga value ng h and k gamit yung formula na to, negative b over 2a for h and 4ac minus b square all over 4a for k naman. So, may value na tayo ng a doon, so isa substitute na lang natin yan. Okay, so let's now find the value of your h then. So, simplify natin. For h, we have negative times negative, you have positive 4 all over 2 times 1 is 2. Again, negative times negative is positive 4. 2 times 1 is 2. 
for k naman, you have, okay, uh, sagutan na natin to 4 divided by 2 is 2. Okay, for k naman, 4 times 1 is 4 times negative 10 is negative 40. Ulit, 4 times 1 is 4 times negative 10 is negative 40. So, minus, okay, negative 4 times negative 4 is positive 16. Ulit. 4 times 1 is 4 times negative 10 is negative 40. Minus, minus, negative 4 times negative 4 is positive 16. All over, 4 times 1 is 4. Simplify natin further. So, negative 40 minus 16 or negative 40, negative 16, you have negative 56. Same sign sila. So, we add 40 plus 16 is 56. And then, we copy the uh, sign, negative 56, all over 4. So, ang value ng k natin dito is negative 56 over 4 is negative 14. That is for your value of your k. Again, so this is the value of your h. This is the value of your k. So, we simply substitute it doon sa saan? Dito sa uh, vertex formula natin na uh, or uh, vertex form natin na uh, f of x equals to a times the quantity x minus h squared plus k. So, substitute natin. So, we have now formula f of x is equal to value ng a natin is 1. Ulitin ko lang. Sulat lang natin ulit yung formula para makita nyo. So, you have x minus h squared plus Okay, so substitute natin, value ng A mo doon is 1. So, simply uh, ignore 1 or understood na yan na pag wala kang nilagay na 1, it's understood na may imaginary 1 ka dyan. So, value ng, again, X, value ng H natin is 2. So, simply minus, uh, substitute mo yung value ng H which is 2 and then square it. Plus K, ang value ng K natin is negative 14. So, ang value, so ang... Uh, form ng x squared minus 4x minus 10 into vertex form will be x minus 2 quantity raised to 2 minus 14. Since ang value ng h natin is positive 2, lagay mo lang yun doon positive 2 and then value ng k natin negative 14. Do not be confused, ha? Huh? So, x minus h palagi yan. Yan yung form natin. So, x minus h, x minus x minus value ng h mo is 2. Just simply uh, substitute the value of your h which is and that's it okay so let's have another example so rewrite f of x equals to x squared minus 8x plus 2 in vertex form so again ang formula natin for h is uh, formula so ang formula natin gagamitin for h will be h equals to negative b over 2a yes at ang value naman ng uh, k formula natin will be 4ac minus b square all over 4a. So, unang solution natin is we're going to find muna yung value ng a, yung value ng b, at value ng c from our quadratic function. So, ang a value natin here will be 1. b value natin will be negative 8. And c value natin will be positive 2 and then we substitute all of this from our quadratic uh, from our formula of h value and formula of our k value so for h we have negative again b value natin is negative 8 so substitute negative 8 all over 2 value ng a natin is 1 so 2a 2 times 1 will be 2 negative negative is positive 8 8 divided by 2 is 4. So, ang h value natin will be positive 4. Now, for k naman, we have uh, 4 ac. So, 4. Value ng a natin is 1. Substitute mo dyan 1. And for c value naman natin, we have 2. Substitute 2 minus. Yung b square natin is negative 8. So, substitute mo dyan negative 8 and then square it. Okay? So, all over... 4, ang value ng A natin is 1. So, simplify this. So, we have 4 times 1 is 4, times 2 is 8. 
So, 8 minus negative 8 times negative 8 is positive 64. So, that will be uh, all over. All over. 4 times 1 is 4. O, simplify natin. So, ang value ng k natin dito will be 8 minus 64 is... And 8 minus 64 is negative 56 divided by 4. So, ang sagot natin for k will be... Okay, that is negative 14. Okay? So, 8 minus 64 is negative 56. Negative 56 divided by 4 is negative 14. So, ang value ng k natin is negative 14. At ang value naman ng uh, h natin is positive 4. Now, we substitute it from our uh, from our vertex form, which is f of x equals to a times x minus h square plus k. So, ang a value natin na nakuha is 1. Substitute mo dyan 1. Pero kahit na uh, no need na ilagay yan, kasi imaginary na yan. It's understood na may 1 ka dyan. And simply attach x minus ang value ng h natin is 4. Simply add 4. Then square it. And at ang value ng k natin is negative 14. So, substitute negative 14. So, this is now our uh, vertex form of the given quadratic function. So, ulitin natin, h value or h formula natin is negative b over 2a. So, ang value ng b natin is negative 8. So, again, may negative yon, negative yan. Substitute natin, negative 8. So, negative negative is positive 8. Divide by 2. Saan ang galing yung 2? Sa 2a. So, ang a value natin is 1. So, 2 times 1 is 2. Neg uh, positive 8. Divide by 2 is positive 4. So, for k naman, ang value ng a natin is 1. Value ng c natin is 2. At ang value ng b natin is negative 8. So, substitute, negative 8. 4 times 1 times 2 is 8. Negative 8 times negative 8 is positive 64. Pero may negative doon, kaya ilagay pa natin yung negative. So, 4a, value ng a is 1. So, 4 times 1 is 4. 8 minus 64 is negative 56. Divide by 4 is negative 14. Value ng h is 4. Value ng k is negative 14. So, substitute na lang natin yan dito sa uh, vertex form natin. A value is 1. Copy x. H value is 4. So, substitute 4. K value is negative 14. Substitute negative 14. Okay? And that's it.